I'm not sure how it's gonna go, but I'm currently on the way to work, unfortunately. I was supposed to be working nine to six today, and you know, that was gonna be great because I was gonna have some time to finish up packing, and make sure I have all the loose ends tied up, but unfortunately, I have to work two to 11, possibly even 12 midnight uh, today because we have to completely redo our store setup. So I'm not sure when I'm gonna get off of work, but hopefully after this little piece, um, you will be getting my travel flight stitched in with it. Um, I fly out at 5.20 in the morning from the airport. That's like 15 minutes away. So it's not gonna be too bad. And there goes my phone. But it's not gonna be too bad. Uh, 5.22, then I land in Atlanta, and then I will be on my way to Florida. I land in Florida, like, depending if there's any delays, uh, which we'll find out here in a minute, at eight something, and from there on out, we'll find out if I'm able to function <laughs> tomorrow at Disney World. Um, Cause I literally, I had Thanksgiving off, but you know, Thanksgiving really didn't feel like an off day because we had a bunch of family over, we were cooking, we were cleaning. Um, so technically I really haven't had an off day in over a week because I actually had to go up to a funeral um, my past off day on Tuesday. So honestly, it's just been a crazy week um, and I packed ahead, but you know, I'm one of those people that repack and repack again just to double check because I have definitely forgot things on trips and it's not good. But at the same time, Disney, you definitely have options um, just in case you do forget something. But I am so excited and hopefully I'll be able to, um, I think I'm gonna bring my laptop to be able to post some stuff while I'm down there. If not, I'm really, really sorry. Um, I'm just gonna post it all at the end. You know, I have, it is a family vacation. Most of my family is gonna be there. Um, so I'm really gonna try my best to just, <clears throat> hang on. Um, I'm really, really gonna try my best just to stay, oh my God. Day one, we went to Hollywood Studios and all the decorations are up for Christmas and it is absolutely gorgeous. One of my favorite places to go for sure. We went right over to Star Wars uh, because my little brother has not been to Disney since he was uh, 10 years old. Um, and this was the fit for the day. Of course, had to get myself a blue milk with some tequila, of course. Um, it's actually one of my favorite drinks. Then we did get some photos with the stormtroopers. This is my favorite picture of the entire trip. You were able to do this photo opportunity if you had a Disney Visa chase card, which was actually really, really cool to be able to do. Uh, we, of course, saw Ray while we were walking around, and then we kind of just wandered around that day. We didn't do too many rides. Um, we actually got to go to Brown Derby. This was my first time ever eating there, and it was 
fabulous. The drinks were fabulous. The food was fabulous. I got, um, a cheesecake drink, uh, which was Hey guys, so I'm really sorry about this short ending to the video. So after we did Brown Derby, we kind of just wandered around um, Hollywood Studios for the rest of the day, but then we actually got a reservation for California Grill. So we actually ended up going back to the hotel a little bit early and ran around gift shops to try to find something nice to wear to California Grill um, because they do have a recommended dress code when you do go up there. Um, so I was kind of running around for the rest of the evening trying to find something to wear because I didn't bring anything really nice to wear for that dinner um, because it was kind of a fluke that we ended up getting that reservation. But you'll see that we had an excellent dinner. They do have a set menu which I need to find. Um, I don't know where we packed them because they do have a set menu for the 50th anniversary and it is definitely worth it. A little expensive, um, but if you catch it at the right time, we had just missed the fireworks, but we were, um, there at like almost 11, um, and then the Christmas fireworks were going to go off for the, um, after hours party, but we missed it. So definitely if you catch it at the right time, it might just be worth it. Thank you.